Step 1. Carefully unbox. Start by carefully opening the box and removing all inner boxes from the shipper box. Each box identifies the speaker channel that is inside. Be sure to save your packaging in the event you need it later. On to step two. Step two, place speakers. Now that you've removed the speakers from the shipper box, begin to remove them from their inner box and place them in their corresponding location for front, surround, center, and subwoofer. Note the position designation on the label located on the back side of each speaker to ensure you place each speaker in the proper position as shown in the diagram below. Step 3. Power Speakers Next, plug in all power adapters to the rear connector on each speaker and subwoofer before plugging into the wall outlets. As you plug them into the wall outlets, you'll notice the blue LED on the back of each speaker and the subwoofer should now be blinking. If not, check your connections to make sure they are all plugged in securely. And don't forget about those pesky wall switches on some outlets. Plug in the smart center after all speakers and subwoofer are plugged in. Step 4. Connect Enclave to your TV using ARC. Next, if you wish to use the ARC audio return channel functionality of your TV and the Enclave audio CineHome, start by connecting the HDMI cable provided in the box from the HDMI output of the Enclave Smart Center to the designated HDMI ARC port on your TV. Your TV's ARC capable HDMI input will be indicated by the words HDMI ARC just below or next to the proper input port. Once this connection is complete and you have set up the rest of the speakers for the Enclave, power on both your Enclave Smart Center and your TV. Using your TV remote, switch to the HDMI ARC enabled input on your TV where you connected the Enclave Smart Center. Once you've made the switch to the proper HDMI input, your screen may be black or you may see that the Enclave speaker pairing process is still at work. Please allow at least 30 seconds for this process to take place. Once you have the All Speakers OK message on your screen, you're ready to proceed with configuring your setup for ARC audio. If the system reports a missing speaker or speakers, check your power connections on all your speakers. If you are continuing to have pairing issues, contact Enclave Technical Support for assistance. Next, using the Enclave Audio Remote or Smart Center keypad, and begin your ARC setup by tapping the menu button one time. From this menu, with the Enclave Remote or keypad, scroll down using the Down to CEC, select CEC, then scroll down again to enable CEC plus ARC, and select it. Next, power cycle the Enclave Smart Center. Simply turn it off, wait 5 seconds, and turn the Smart Center back on. Once powered on again, select Input on the Enclave Remote or Smart Center and scroll down to AUX ARC and select the AUX ARC input source. You have now enabled the ARC functionality of the Enclave Smart Center. If your TV is already CEC ARC enabled, you will see a confirmation via a blue box on top of your screen that says ARC. In the event your TV's CEC ARC functionality is not enabled, this can usually be done through the TV's settings menu and can vary by manufacturer. Such names as BrabiaLink, AnyNet Plus, SimpLink, Viralink, are all brand names for this functionality, which can usually be found in the TV's General Settings or Advanced Settings menu. We recommend speaking to your TV manufacturer's support team or referring to your owner's manual for specific instructions based on your specific TV make and model. Step 5. Enjoy Immersive Sound. Last, select the HDMI input on your TV to the desired viewing source you have connected to your TV or any onboard smart app and you're all set. If you just need some help, reach out to our tech support team at 844-436-2528 and we'll get you up and running in no time. 
Welcome to the world of Enclave Audio Wireless Home Theater. 